peace, love, and blessings for me to each and every one of y'all out there, guys. Thanks so much for joining me today. We're here at the Red Brick Wall, and today's workout, we're going to be doing some cardio and abs, but strictly working on that strength. Really going to look to build that six pack strength, uh, work on some definition of the abs, and yeah, just keep this thing rolling that we got going. We got a good thing going, so why should we break it off? All right, so we're going to get started with our favorite warm up. It's going to be a slightly different uh, format of things today. Nonetheless, it's still the same workout, still the same warm, warm up. So in seven seconds, we get started with jogging on the squat. Put that big smile on your face, shake your body out, and let's get started. So we're jogging on the squat, keep your water close by. We're gonna take the intensity up from the very beginning. We wanna max it out today. Burn as many calories as we can. Seven seconds to go. Five, four, all right, what's next? We're coming into butt kickers. Ready, three, two, one. All right, let's get it. So we're getting those heels coming up. Remember to modify for butt kickers. You stay on the squat and you just bounce it out, taking the hop out. That's it, straight strong. Breathe. Bring the fist up to shoulders. All right, five seconds to go. Coming up next, we've got jumping jacks. Modification, you just step side to side. All right, that's the modification. Full movement, you more jumping jacks. Keep your arms wide and breathe. Come on, we want you to literally give it anything more than 80% from the beginning. You want that heart rate to get up nice and slow, nice and gentle. All right, twist hops, ready? That's it, side to side. Keep those elbows high, relax your shoulders down, twist the hips, side to side. 10 seconds to go from here, we're right back to the top. Got two circuits to get through. There is a burnout round as always. 30 minutes of fun. All right, high knees. Let's get your knees coming up. The jump is too much. Remember, you stay on the squat and you march it up. I said, keep your abs tight. Get your knees up tighter than your, your hip. I said, five seconds to go. Four, three, landing lightly on those feet. Stay nice and tall. We've got butt kickers next. Ready? Knees down, heels up. Keep swinging those arms. Keep those abs engaged. Oh yeah. Yeah, this is ready right here. Getting that heart nice and pumping and ready. Blood moving around the body. Muscles getting loose. The joints are getting warm. Five seconds to go before we head into jumping jacks. Ready? Three, two. White arms. Bring those arms up above the head. Jump your feet side to side. Keep your knees nice and soft and breathe. I hope you got your accountability partner there getting in these workouts with you. Keeping the workouts rolling. Five seconds to go, guys. We've got twist hops next. Remember, bring those elbows high, relax your shoulders down, and twist the hips from side to side. I say, have some fun with the movement. Stay playful, but push and challenge yourself. 10 seconds to go. Breathe. From here, we're heading all the way back to the top. We're gonna go through this one more time before we come to our workout. Ready, three, two, one. All right, knees up. Come on, really intense step. Get those knees up higher than the hips. Add the arms. Give me some more energy here. Squeeze the abs. That's it. 10 seconds. Come on, I can see you. Get those legs up a little bit higher. Let's get that sweat. Inducing the sweat. Three seconds, two, one. Knees down. Heels up. That's it. Relax those ankles. Stay safe here. Ten seconds to go. Come on. Just give me a little bit more. A little bit more. Five seconds. Hold on. Don't you let go. Three. Up next. Jumping jacks. Ready? Two. One. All right. Let's get it. Arms away. Big chest. All right. We're going into speed jacks. So bring the elbows up to 90 degrees. You got it. Land it lightly on those feet. Still breathing. Be in total control here. Three, two, all right, final movement. Twist hops, ready? And go for it. Elbow side, relax your shoulders. Twist those hips from side to side. Oh yeah. Beautiful morning in Singapore. It's pretty overcast today, but the sun is out. The humidity is here and the heat is right here at the red brick wall. Let's go guys. Let's get them abs in order. Three, two, one. All 
Alright, beautiful. So if you need to stop here, I invite you to stop, take a little sip of water. See, I got my big thousand milliliter right here. It's gonna be my sidekick today. So I invite you to take a sip of that. If not, let's get some stretching. So gently, we're gonna pull on the left side of the neck. Nothing too strenuous, just a gentle pull. Bring the right ear to the shoulder. All right, bring it up to center and switch to the other side. Nice deep breaths there, guys. All right, cool. Up to center, we're bringing the chin into chest. So gently pull on the back of the neck, tucking that chin into your body. Just, uh, let's take that chin to the sky now. Reaching up to the sky with the chin. Good stuff, shake that upper body out, give it a shake. Really lovely shake, we're gonna inhale, reaching up and overhead, exhale, forward fold. So we're touching our toes here. Add a slight bend to the knees if you need to, as if your flexibility in the hamstrings isn't that great as yet. Just bend your knees for some assistance, or you can keep them straight. Now, what we're gonna do here is we're gonna take our fingertips and we're walking them over to the left side, stretching that side of the body. Press down into your left heel. All right, bring it back to center, and let's do the same thing on the other side. Stuff. Big stretch. All right, come into center. Bring it all the way up. Now we're going into a lunge. Just want to take that right leg forward into a really big lunge, keeping the knee suspended, pressing through that back heel so that the leg is straight. Knee above ankle in the front leg. And what we're going to do here, guys, is we're going to take our left hand, plant it down onto the mat or onto the ground, and take the right arm and add a twist. Big twist. That's it. Stretching that spine out. All right, switch hands. So the right hand takes the left hand's place. Press that right palm down into the ground and reach overhead with the left. Good stuff. All right, cool. Turn your toes toward me. Walk your fingertips to the center. Now, what I want you to do is take your fingertips and reach between your legs all the way behind, as far back as you can. Press into the outer edges of your feet. And let's take it forward. So you're gonna walk your fingertips as far forward as you can. Now, you've got the option here of keeping them on the ground or you can hover just about an inch or two. Keep pressing into the outer edges of your feet. Stay strong, good stuff. Back to center. Let's do that lunge on the other side. So walking over to the left, we're gonna point your left toes forward. Uh, the knee and the left leg is above the ankle. That back leg is nice and straight. That's a strong lunge right there. Once you got that set up, right hand comes to the mat first. <sighs> Stack all your joints and then reach that left arm up to the sky. Switch hands, left hand down, right hand up. Always remember the importance of stretching, guys. It's super duper duper important just to get a bit of a stretch in before you start your workout. So, you to those feet inward. We're gonna start on the ankles. Some ankle rolls. You guys, prepare yourselves. We've got two circuits to get through. It will be interesting and a burnout round. All right, guys, get that model. Coming right back for circuit. Okay, we're gonna go ahead and get started with our first circuit. So we're gonna need in, gonna be needing your yoga mat. So get that mat spread out. And in these circuits, we got eight movements. We're gonna be, we're gonna be working for a, a, a total of 35 seconds, resting for five seconds after each, and then we repeat, all right? So circuit number one, we're flat on the mat. It's 35 seconds on, five seconds off, eight movements. The first movement we've got, guys, push throughs. So we're gonna get started in 10 seconds with those push throughs. Lift flat on your back. Tuck your heels in, you got it. Extend the arms outward. Now, I want to contract your abs really tight. Extend those arms and up and reach. So focus on getting your shoulder blades off the mat, up as high as you can. That's it. Every time you come up, you breathe up.
legs up and off. Keep reaching those elbows to your knees. Let's get two more. One more. All right, good stuff. What's next? We've got sprinter abs. So keep your legs, legs nice and long. Bring your legs up into chest. Modification here, you keep one leg just slightly bent. So that assists you to get to the opposite leg up. All right, you want more, take those legs down flat, drag the knee up, come up to a seated position. No momentum, just abs working. Oh yeah, through the core working already. We've got just about 10 seconds to go before we come to our fourth movement. I still keep breathing. Three, let's get one more. Oh, all right, good work. All right guys, up next we've got leg raise combo. So place your hands under your bum, bring those knees into your chest. We're gonna take your legs up nice and long and then bring them up. So it's a circular motion, legs down, in, and out. Back up, you got it. Keep them long, keep your abs tight, keep pulling the navel into your spine. The lower you take your legs, the tougher it is. It's barely to get those heels to brush the ground. There you go. Lift those legs up. When they come up, they're coming up nice and straight. You got it, relaxing that down. Let's get one more. All right, good stuff, guys. Up next, we've got dead bugs. So you're flat on your back, knee above the hip. You're gonna reach both arms up, left leg and right arm, they extend outward and switch. Focus on pulling that navel into your spine. Focus also on keeping your lower back on the mat. That's it, breathe. Three seconds on, five seconds off. Keep reaching that leg. We got 10 seconds to go. Stick with it. Oh. All right, guys. We've got mountain climbers next. So we're over to plank. Ready? Let's get those knees forward. Now we're working slow here. No speed. Just drive that knee forward towards the elbow. Keep your hand directly under your shoulder as well. All right, get strong plank. Get that knee coming forward. About 20 seconds to go before we come to our first cardio move. Come on, stay strong. We've got 13 seconds. Keep those abs engaged, guys. We got 10 seconds to go. Seven, six, five. Keep stepping. Four, three, two. Ready? All right, let's stand up. All right, cardio move. We've got wall climbers. Ready? Three, two, one. Modification. You march on the squat. Reach opposite arm, opposite leg. Up, all right? 35 seconds from here, guys. We're back to the top. Getting that sweat. Working the abs. 20 seconds. That's it, keep reaching. Keep your knees coming up high. All right, final 10. All right, you got it. Don't give in. From here, we're done on the mat on our back. Ready? All right, transition. Quick transition, flat on your back, tuck your heels in, extend those arms outward, and let's get the shoulder blades up and off. Lift as high as you can, breathe out every time you come up. Crunching them abs, man. Ooh, yeah. It's a good thing it isn't Sunday, because we will call it six pack Sunday. <laughs> That's it, abs engaged, we're reaching, we're really getting the abs on fire today. Oh, keep lifting. Still there. Oh. All right, what's next? We've got those elbow to knee crunches. Tabletop position. Bring the elbows all the way up. Oh. That's it, guys. How's your core feeling? Mine is on fire. Ugh. But I'm working, I'm pushing through. Come on, we can do this together. Just keep lifting as high as you can. Keep those abs engaged for the next seven seconds. Keep lifting. Let's get two more. Ooh. Woo. All right, sprinters, legs along. That's it, no momentum, just core. Drive, up, abs, tight, squeeze. Breathe. 
You got it. Oh, use an obstacle lift too. 35 seconds on, five seconds off. Gently press yourself back down and lift up again. Come on, pose like a sprinter. Lift yourself up. You can do it. It's about seven seconds to go. Ooh. Let's get one more. Okay, good stuff. Now, leg, leg raise combo. So legs in, we're working the opposite way this time. So take the legs up and gently lower before you pull them back in. Keep those hands under your bum. You want more, lift the bum up and off the mat. Add a slight reverse crunch here. Oh, lower those legs. Total control as you lower them down. Flex your toes toward you. Yeah. Woo. Ten seconds. Keep working. Keep getting it. <sighs> Multi climbers. No dead bugs. All right. So on your back, knee above hip. Reach that arm all the way up. Reach that leg even further. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Roll back stairs on the mat as you reach and you become a dead bug. Oh my goodness. Knees was a killer. Keep breathing. That's it. Five seconds guys. Stick with it. Get that leg long. Abs are tight. Oh. And now we got those mountain climbers. Ready? Three, two, one. Strong plank. Knees are forward. No speed. We got these planks covered, right? All you guys, hopefully you've been doing the jump start. If not, I'll place a link right here. So you can get on that jump start. 30 days of fun. All right, guys, we got 10 seconds to go. Stick with it, keep that plank strong, keep that bomb low. You got six seconds, five, four, three, two. All right, what's next? We got those wall climbers. Ready? All right, up and get it. Let's get some cardio. We've got two more moves to go before we come to the end of circuit number one. Get those knees up, reach your arms out. So we're gonna stop here a little bit early here. Ready? Seven seconds. Keep working. Get your knees up a little bit higher. Five, four, three, two, one, all right, relax. We're coming down to the mat. The reason why I stop you, the bonus two moves, whole body crunches, all right? So knees, you start with the knees, into chest just like me, ready? Reach your both arms and legs out. Lift the upper body up and off the mat and crunch. So reach, 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 crunch. Whole body crunches, that's it. Working the entire abdomen here. Upper lower. That's it, and reach. Lift up as high as you can. And when your abs are fatiguing, reach those legs, reach those arms, and bring it up. And breathe. Let's get one more. Relax. All right, guys, we got that one more time. Three, two, one. I find this lady's count to the five second rest a little too fast. <laughs> oh, that's it, guys. Come on, be strong. Challenging ourselves here. Keep that head down and then bring it back up as you crunch your entire body in. Legs are coming in. Oh. Abs are tight. Relax your neck. Got me holding my legs sometimes. Come on. We've got seven seconds. Reach and crunch. Let's get two more. One more. All right, guys. That's circuit number one. Got a quick water break and we're right back in for number two. So we're back circuit number two. We're done on the mat warming time. Uh, again, 35 seconds on, five seconds off, eight movements, and we repeat for some more fire right here on the mat. Cool. So we're gonna start it first with Russian twist. Alright, modification, you keep your knees bent and feet rounded just like mine are, and you just twist left to right. Alright, rotate it through the core. If you guys want some more, you're gonna go for lifting up the legs. Are you ready? 
Russian twist in three. Let's get a little bit off the wall here. Ready? Five, four, three, two. All right, I'll go for my legs up. That's it. Whoa. A little, a little shaky here. <laughs> Stay strong in the core. Twisting your arms left to right. Remember your options here, guys. If you need to, you drop those feet down for some more stability and less intensity on the core. We've got 15 seconds. Squeeze them abs. 12 seconds. Oh, yeah. You got it. Reach all the way around. Four. Three. From here, we're going all the way down onto the mat. Ready? All right. So we flatten our backs. We've got bicycle ab modification. Ready? Let's go. Fingertips behind. We're going one, two, reach. One, two, three. You got it? One, two, one, two. Keep that rhythm. Elbow to knee. Two, one, two, three. Big twist. Two shoulder blade off the mat. Got it. Oh, we've got 12 seconds to go. Keep twisting. Two, one, two, three. Let's get some more in, guys. Reach that elbow up. One, two, three. One, two. All right, good stuff. We're coming into side planks. So, right elbow on the right shoulder. We're gonna stack our feet here. Lift that arm all the way up. Remember the options for the arm. You can either come down to the ground, onto your hip, or up into the air. All right, keep those hips lifted high as you can. Final 15 seconds, we're gonna add a hip drop. Ready? All right, let's go. So take those hips down and lift them all the way back up. Use that arm if you need to for some leverage. Don't be shy. Listen to your body. You know where you're at in terms of your strength and your capabilities. We've got four seconds to go before we switch it out and do it on the other side. Ready? Let's take it over to the other side. Ready? Elbow on the shoulder. Lift those hips up. Keep those feet stacked. Or the modification I forgot to offer. Bend that leg that's on the bottom. Extend the leg that's on the top. All right? Still lifted until the final 15. Here we get them hip drops in. High as you can. Ready? In three, two, one. Lower those hips and lift. Even if you're modified, guys. You got it. Press your body up and away using that elbow. Reaching the arm up or if it's on your hips, whatever you do. Still to the best of your ability. Let's get one more. All right, this time. We're coming into plank. Ready? Three, two, one. Strong plank. We're gonna bring that left leg, the outside of the elbow, inside the elbow, and outside. Switch to the other side. So it goes outside, inside, outside. Switch. That's it. Now if you can't touch your elbow, that's completely fine. Just work with what your body allows you. Go. Outside, inside, outside. Switch. Keep that bum low. Keep the strong foundations of a plank. Outside. Come on. Inside. Outside. Let's get one more. All right, guys. Good work. Up next, we got plank jacks. So we don't alter our elbows. Elbow under shoulder. Keep that body nice and low. And we're stepping. Left leg outside. All right. So step. Center. Step. Center. Step. Keep your body really straight. So whatever level you at, guys, if this is too much, you just hold that plank. Whatever you do, keep your body straight. You don't want your bum to be too high in the air or to be too low down. We've got 12 seconds to go. Five seconds. From here, we're standing up. Ready? Three, two, one. All right, let's get it. We've got burpees. Ready? Three, two, one. Modification. Start standing just like me. Step your legs, hands down, back into plank and bring it all the way back up before you go again. That's your modification. You got it. Push yourself as much as you can. We got one more move before we take this thing back to the top. 20 seconds. Strong plank, get those legs in. Find your rhythm, keep that rhythm. Six seconds to go. All right, next movement, power knees. You're gonna inhale, reach your left arm up and over. Right arm goes up to join it. You're driving that knee up as you pull your arms down. Now, engage your core here. 
If this is too much, feel free just to put your fingertips behind your head and twist, okay? That's it. Move from place of stability. Keep that core tight. 15 seconds. 10 to go. From here, we back down onto the mat with those Russian twists. Seven seconds, six, five, four, keep the abs tight, three, two, keep reaching, four. All right, three seconds, two, one. Let's get those twists in. Second round, feet up if you need, or feet down. Whatever you do, engage your core. Pull down, navel into your spine, and challenge yourself. Don't only move the arms, move the entire upper body. You're twisting, you're rotating. It's one of the purposes of the core. Rotation, side bending. Oh yeah. Stay lifted, guys. You don't only want a strong, sexy core, you want a functional core. Oh, we got three seconds, stick with it. Two, one, two. All right, crisscrosses. Ready, flat on the mat. One, two, one, two, three. That's it. One, legs long. One, two, three. Reach that elbow for the knee. Two, three. Oh, one, keep lifting. Two, one, three. Breathe. Two, one, two. Oh yeah, get that leg in, get that elbow up. Seven seconds to go. Two, oh, one, two. Keep working guys, hear the buzzer in a second. Uh, one. Wow. All right, quick transition, side plank. Might be a modification here. Bend that leg on the bottom if you need it. All right, so we're gonna change it up slightly. See this arm on the top? At 20 seconds, we're gonna take that arm, reach down through and up. That's if you want more. Ready, three, two. Let's give it a challenge. Reach that left arm through behind you and then open back up the chest. 15 seconds, stay lifted, keep your hips up, even if you're adding the movement. That's it. Seven seconds to go. Keep to swing. Keep your hips up. Three seconds, two, one. All right, let's do the other side. Elbow on the shoulder, three, two, one. Lift your way up. Arms are high, hips are high. Once you got that, guys, you hold this position, all right? Hold it with all that you have. Ready to reach in three, two, one. Right arm reaches under and through and then pulls whatever that is that's behind you, up and above you. That's it. Don't you jeopardize your form. If this is too wobbly, guys, just hold it. That's it, keep your hips up. Three, two, one. All right, good stuff. Here we are, inside, outside. So into plank, strong plank. Outside, inside, outside, switch. Switch, mm. switch, strong plank. Keep that hand under your shoulder. Get that knee as far forward as you can. Keep your bum down, inside. 15 seconds, I hope you're dripping with sweat. I wish you a sweaty day. Come on, you got seven seconds, don't let your bum drop. Oh my God, five seconds to go. Breathe, let's get one more. Outside, inside, and relax. All right, plank jacks. We're down onto forearms. Ready? Step in. Body straight. Working with control right here. Keep those elbows under your shoulder. Keep your bum down and keep those legs moving. Step to the left. Step to the right. 15 seconds. Oh my gosh. Squeeze them out. We're going home strong. It's a sneaky arm workout. Five seconds to go. One, two. Get one more. All right. All right, guys, we're up to standing. We've got those burpees. Remember your modification. Take the modification if you need it. Let's get sweaty, sweatier. Slipping in sweat, dripping with sweat. Everything is sweat. Then take it up. 22 seconds. All the way up, all the way down, guys. Make sure you get back into that strong plank. Before you bring your legs in, oh, I go to the next move. Seven seconds. 
keep it going. And relax. All right. Inhale, reach that right arm up and over. Remember the option here. Fingertips behind the head. And you can drive your knee up. All right. If not, extend the arms. It's going to make you work your arms just a bit more. Get that knee up. Stabilizing through the left side of the body. Squeezing the abs. And driving that right knee up. You're pulling whatever that is up there. Pulling it down onto the knee. 10 seconds to go, guys. Final move before the burnout. Seven seconds. Still lifted. Six, five, four, three, two. Don't you stop. Ah, good work. All right, we got the burnout. We've got 40 seconds before we begin. There are five movements. Each movement 30 seconds long. So we're working for a total of two minutes and 30 seconds. Take a sip of water. There you go. What's the movements we got? We got the whole body crunches, Russian twists. There's sprinter abs, plank jacks, and burpees. All right? We got just about 15 seconds before we start. Mm -hmm. All right. Remember those whole body crunches? We coming back to them in five seconds. So lay flat on your mat, extend your, get your knees in, hug them in the chest, ready? It's 30 seconds each move. Reach your legs, reach your arms, and bring them back in. Just make sure it's not spilling. There we go. Reach and crunch. Reach, we've only got enough time for transitions, which is two seconds. 10 seconds. Get your arms back, get your legs out. Up next, guys, Russian twist. Ready? Right, we up. Let's get those twists. I've got my legs down right now. My hip flexors are killing me. As I keep twisting, the entire body's moving. Sorry, the entire upper body is moving. Ah. Oh. Quick shake out. Come on, it's the burnout. 10 seconds to go. Seven, six. Five, four, three, that's a quick peek at the next move. We've got spring to abs. Ready? All right, flat on the mat, body long, opposite arm, opposite leg, driving up. Remember, no momentum here, only your core is working. Breathe. Oh. Get that leg up. All right, we've got 10 seconds left before we switch to the next move. Plank jacks. That's it, let's keep pulling yourself up. Three, two, all right, let's take it over the plank. Ready, three, two, one. Plank jacks, this time I'm gonna add a hop. All right, add that bit of a jump, or you can step it. The legs are feeling me. Uh, come on. 15 seconds, 14, 13, oh, okay. Uh, all right, we got about seven seconds to go before we come to final movement, which are the burpees. Ready? Three, two, uh. All right, let's go. Get those burpees. That's the last movement of the burnout. Get it all together. Come on. Let's keep a rhythm. Give me all your butt. Taking it home strong. 17 seconds. 16, 15. Come on. Let's get more. Take that body out, jump it up into the air. Stick with the breath. We've got final five seconds, guys. Don't stop until the buzzer. You're taking it home strong. Oh, beautiful work, guys. We've got a mess here. We've got a phone, water bottle, mat, sweat. Oh my goodness. Beautiful workout today, guys. Let's get a really quick stretch in. So get back to your breath, in through the nose, all through your mouth. Or take a sip of water if you need it. Once you're done, just meet me right here. And let's stretch it out. Just gonna inhale, interlace both fingertips above you and pressing those fingertips up to the sky. Come on, we're coming all the way back down to that breath that we started with. Nice and calm, remember? Remember what it was before you were this sweaty? 
exhale, release both arms. We're gonna inhale, reach that left arm up and over. We're creating length from that pinky all the way down to the left heel. Stretch those obliques out, that's it, big stretch. Good stuff, right, coming up to center, inhale, and exhale over to the opposite side. Remember, you want that arm that's outstretched to be nice and long. That way you put the lats and the obliques on full stretch. Press the hip away from you. All right, coming up to center, guys. Gonna inhale one more time. Interlace the fingertips above, add a slight back bend here. So we're gently bending the back, reaching behind us. That's it, exhale, just touch your toes. Walk your way down your legs. Just let the body hang here, guys. No resistance, you're just chilling and stretching. Good stuff. All right, coming onto all fours, let's get that mat. So down on your all fours, knees are hip width apart, knee under hip, hand under shoulder. We're gonna inhale, reach that spine up to the sky. Tuck your chin, tuck your hips under you, tailbone to the earth, exhale, tailbone to sky. Navel and the entire belly drops down. Press yourself up and away as the head comes to the back of the body. Right, inhale, tail one under, chin comes in, upper back lifts to the sky. Final time, guys. Inhale, head to the back of the body. Tummy to the ground, tail one to the sky. Good stuff. All right, cool. Just let me start in the beginning. We're gonna take that right leg, big step forward into a lunge. Shifting your body weight off that kneecap itself. You want to be anywhere in the lower portion of the thigh, just above the knee. Keep your body weight shifting forward, knee above ankle on the right leg, and bring both arms to the inside of that leg. There you go. Stretching the hip flexors out. This is the muscle that was failing on me as it did my abs. Hip flexors, that's what's responsible for walking, for running, for any movement that involves hip flexion or lifting your leg. Hip flexors. A little bit of anatomy in there. All right, cool. We're gonna recline towards the hamstrings, towards the heels, sorry. Extend that right leg in front of you. Relax your toes. Now, take your fingertips, walk them forward. Just tinkle, 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 bring them forward. Chest to thighs. And now let's do this on the other side. So first we're coming into hip stretch. Big straight up with that left foot. Remember left ankle and knee in alignment. You're just above that kneecap, shifting your body weight in a forward direction. Both arms do what? They come up over onto the inside of that leg. Take the self down. You guys that got a bit more flexibility you can feel free to head on down to your forearms for a deeper stretch. I'll just chill out right here for now. All right, guys, final stretch. We're taking it backward, reclining towards the heel, not on the heel. Relax the toes of the left foot, extend that leg nice and long and tingle those fingertips. Forward to the front of your mat, towards the leg as you bring your chest down to thighs. So we're bringing the heart rate all the way back down. Cool down and warm up. All important components of any workout, guys. That's a good stretch there. If you guys need any more stretching, I've got a couple stretch videos on the channel. Look for that playlist, it's called uh, Basic Stretch Videos. Uh, I'll put a link for that actually right here. And what you guys can feel free to do is just after every workout, if this stretch was not enough for you and you need to get any deeper stretches, Feel free to do one of those videos anywhere between 15 to 30 minutes long. Guys, thank you so much for joining me today uh, for this sweaty cardio ab session. It's really been a pleasure. It's always fun working out with you guys right here at the Red Brick Wall. FYI, I hate working abs. This is like my weak point, but it's the point that I really need to put more effort in. So just by staying accountable to you guys, bringing more ab workouts to you, tons more videos to come. Guys, as always, continue to share that love and inspiration to those who you come into contact with. Like this video, you subscribe to my channel and spread it to everyone that you know. Guys, get up, get out, and get moving. Peace.